I watched my life change from going from a state champion soccer player to being involved in an accident that resulted in me losing my left leg. As soon as it happened, people asked me like, what am I gonna do? And I've never asked myself that again because I kind of just figured it out after that. There's a bigger purpose out of everything that happens to us. People avoid hardship in a lot of ways, but going through hard things shows you that you're able to get through those. That's how people grow and build. My name is Lexi Coupler, and I run an adaptive wake surfing program called Brave the Wave. She's always pushing herself out of her comfort zone. She encourages others to do that. So that's led into me going outside of my comfort zone more and more. Not always the best experience, but it always leads to something greater, either in my self, personality, or something that I'm learning about myself at the time. Knowing what I know from people's stories and from what people saw happen, I should not be alive. I think it's so easy to question things and to be like, why did this happen? But as soon as we let ourselves go to that, you can't find reasons, but you can find purpose out of what you've gone through. And I think that's where my faith comes into play is trusting without knowing the reason something happened. I've grown up in the water, so as soon as the next summer rolled around, I jumped right back in. I know how much I love wake surfing and how much I even love to just get on the water, and I want to share that with everyone. Pass your car on every street. It's not about wake surfing at the end of the day because there are so many little things that have changed people's life just in the steps of getting in the water from maybe never jumping off the back of the boat into the water before or little steps along the way that as boaters we don't think about but as to other people coming out doing this for the first time it's changing their lives it's something they never thought they would do the two aspects that I've like come into brave the wave is her passion for doing fun things and then her compassion for like bringing people together but a cool opportunity that she's intentionally done with the program is putting everybody on the boat at the same time so you get to talk to your neighbor or your friend who maybe have something similar going on in life maybe not but at the same time like still growing that community and helping you come out of this with a new friendship Lexi just makes you want to be a better person um, and everything she does for people, you want to just help her and you want to just become more like her. It's been a blessing. It's been a miracle, I think, to just have the right people find you along your way. I think the biggest thing kind of has been to give back to people. That's what's the most fulfilling at the end of the day. I don't think there's a goal that's going to be too big that you can't achieve but it's figuring out how to achieve it. And that's what's the important part, is taking those baby steps along the way. You have to always give yourself grace because there's going to be hard days that you wish that this wasn't your life or maybe this wasn't what you were going through, but also there are such good days in that. And so grace has been my biggest thing. You have to remember to do that for yourself no matter what happens. I live a hard story to the outside world, but I think to me it's an amazing story because I love it. I think I have having so much fun with it. My truth would be to own your story and whatever that may be, own that and live that because that's your story and no one else can choose that for you. Choosing how you live that every day is you being your true self and living your truth.